Hey guys, Dworks here, showing you how to easily beat Okra in Terraria. I recommend using the Golden Shower, a godly ranked possessed hatchet, and a tactical shotgun with chlorophyte bullets. Enjoy watching me destroy Alcram for I don't know what time. I have, I have a grave that actually says how many times I've beaten Alcram because I died while fighting the um, Frost Moon. And if you guys are wondering what armor I recommend for using this, I recommend Beetle Armor because it's actually really good. What you should use most of this fight with, I would definitely say the tactical shotgun. It's what I used to do most of the fight with. I just recommend the possessed hatchet because it can lock on to him. Oh shit. My fault. Okay. The golden shower lowers his defense, so I really recommend using the golden shower for every boss. If you're wondering how you get it, you use Icor. If you need to kill the Icor stickers. And you need to do this spike glitch thing to be able to take him out extremely easily with barely taking any damage and you need all gold hearts and full beetle armor because with the beetle armor you don't take that much damage from spikes considering it reduces any damage taken from anything by 45 percent when you have the beetle endurance perk on and that comes with the armor if you didn't know that and if you guys want to know how to kill any other bosses extremely easily, I can tell you to I can tell you those two. Except for Duke Fishron. Cause I haven't beaten Duke Fishron yet. I've beaten every other boss except for Duke Fishron. So you wanna know how to beat Skeltron Prime? Easy. You wanna know how to beat Plantera? Maybe easy. Because it takes a while to beat her. Ocaram's got like two health. There we go. Ocaram's dead. I started this at the beginning of night, which is seven. So it only takes about three in game hours. So it's about a three minute long real life time fight. And yes, I have the Terrorblade. I have three of them. I think. Okay, let's see how many times Ocarim I have killed Ocarim before this. Oh wait, yeah, I have beaten Duke Fisher on. Once. Um, that's the 21st time. Again, I really do hope you guys did see me beat Ocaram on camera. It's not a very big deal for me beating Ocaram, but I just want everyone to have proof that I've beaten Ocaram. And that thing I was doing, you just want a bunch of spikes and campfires. If you don't know where to find spikes and you want to do the glitch to be able to beat Ocarim extremely easily, go to the dungeon or the lizard temple or the lizard temple and go and get spikes from there. Oh God, my arm stealer! Really, a stupid possessed armor? Okay, so what was that? How did I die? Oh, the ever screen. So, 
Yeah. Oh, I have two terror blades. Thought I had three. Oh, I do have three. My cousin's gonna make one himself. I think that too. No, it isn't. And I also have the Paladin's Hammer, two cutlasses, and the Tizona. Which is actually a pretty cool weapon. And I have a bone sword, two bean swords, a key brand, Muramasa to make another nice edge. But I'm not using this broken hero sword or these two weapons. The true Excalibur and the, and the true knight's edge. If you're wondering how you make these, if you're like new to Terraria or something, what you do is you just combine them with a broken hero sword. Like you combine the normal knight's edge and the normal Excalibur with broken hero swords. So you, you need three broken hero swords to make the weapon. One for the Excalibur to make the true Excalibur. One for the true knight's edge, or one for the knight's edge to make the true knight's edge, and then combine those both with one more to get the terror blade. This one's mine. That's the one to my cousins. They're both the same. Very well. This one's mine. That one's also kind of mine. I went and made another one, and then had another solar eclipse. So I got like three more broken hero swords. And if you're wondering how you get this, you get it from fighting the golem. And as you can see, I have the golem altar up here on my house. To get the golem altar, you need the pick saw, and then you can just go and pick it up. And then put it down. If you have any power cells, you can just fight the golem on top of your house. That is really cool. Again, why do I keep getting spectral headgear? <sighs> I did have the Titan chest plate, but apparently the Titan chest plate is one of the worst armor ever. Because I'm pretty sure the dragon armor is actually better. And then the beetle armor that I'm wearing is actually better than that. And the hollowed hat is the only, like the hollowed helmet, is the only thing that is better than what I have. Fifteen defense. Eighteen. Beetle armor is better in that section. Let's see. The helmet, spectral headgear, ten defense. You know what? No, we're not looking at spectral. We're looking at Titan. So for the Titan mask, or Titan helmet, I mean, the Titan helmet is fourteen defense. Mine is twenty three defense. If you're wondering what those little black things are flying around me, those are beetles. Don't be racist, please. I love my beetles. And the chest plate. This is how you don't make the beetle scale mail. Make this. The beetle shell. You need the turtle scale mail. And eight beetles. And eight um, beetle husks. You get these from killing the golem. Looking tight and stuff, so 18 defense, 32. Yeah, the beetle stuff is way better. How do you leave 
need shoemate parts. That's what I want to know. Does anyone know how to make shroomite? If you do, please post it in the comments because I really want to know how to make shroomite. Oh wait, I do know how to make shroomite. Actually, it's just chlorophyte and mushrooms. Never mind. And by the way, this can't go through walls and it can only hit one of your enemies. The Paladin's hammer can't go through walls either. Though the Paladin can throw his through walls. But it goes through your enemies. But if you go and like throw it like that. And actually get it through where you're throwing it. It can come back to do a wall. Throw it here. Go there. Throw it here. Go there. Here. There. See? It went through a wall. And I also have the Dow of Power somewhere. Alright guys, so that's the end of this video. So...